Yo, what is up? What is poppin'? Back at it again with another video for y'all. Just want to motivate y'all, spread some awareness with y'all, some knowledge. And this is a video for, like, another video about the school system. This is a video for the parents and for the teachers. For the students that, like, have low exam scores, like, you don't really give those students a lot of recognition like you do with the other students. Those students, they're, they're just like the other students. Give them the same recognition. Like, you're not, yeah, like, don't categorize, don't categorize the student for having low exam scores. Inside of them, they have a passion. Inside of them, they have intelligence. Inside of them, I mean, they're smart. Just because they have low exam, low exam scores doesn't make them any different. But you see, the way the school system is set up, they, they, they like to categorize the students. It seems to me, it seems to me like it's all about competition. It shouldn't really be about competition. Like, are students really learning anything in school? Like, the school system here in the U.S. has been a joke for years. Like, it's like kids are not really learning anything in school. So it's no wonder why school be making students less intelligent, less intelligent. But yeah, don't categorize. Just because the student has low exam scores, they deserve the same recognition like the other students do. Don't treat them like an outcast. Like as a teacher, like it, like being a school teacher is one of the most important jobs. But then again, I know a lot of you school teachers, you know, feel some type of way due to the fact that you don't really make a lot of money as a teacher. But as a school teacher, you can actually bring a gift out of a student. You know, like a lot of, you know, a lot of, a lot of people don't even know what their gifts are because school never bring the gift out of them. Yeah, but for that student that has low exam scores, for that student that's probably failing all of their classes, they're just, they're just like everybody else. I mean, they're, they're just, they're just depressed. They're depressed. Inside of them, they do have a passion. You, you, you could be that teacher. You could be that parent that brings the gift out of that student because that student deserves the same recognition. That student is the chosen one. That student is born to stand out. You know what I mean? But yo, know, the, the school system really needs to stop categorizing. Don't categorize. Everybody deserves equal recognition in school. You know what I mean? Yeah, because, like, you got students that sit in the back of the class that don't really get a lot of recognition. The teacher probably don't even know the student's name. They know everybody else's name, but not that student because the teacher doesn't give that student recognition. I mean, I know how that is. I know how that is. You know, I mean, but, you know, you know teachers, it's, it's, it's very important to give all of the students the same equal recognition even even if the student has an IEP even if the student is an EC just because they're an EC doesn't mean that they're retarded not every student that's an EC is retarded i mean if the student is like driving and also like you know like has like a job working like in high school it don't mean that they're retarded e e even even if the student is retarded special needs they're just like everyone else they're just like everyone else i mean don't categorize yeah yeah the, yeah the, don't categorize everybody deserves the same opportunity everybody deserves the same recognition and and just because the student has low exam scores it doesn't mean it doesn't mean that they're slow it doesn't mean that they're slow and 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 also for the students if you have a if you have a disability if you have a learning disability it's it, don't don't think that it's ever impossible for you to achieve success you still have a gift you still have you still have a god given ability you still have a strength i mean yeah i understand you have a disability a learning disability but don't ever think that it's impossible for you to achieve success you can achieve success you can get something above getting a job working at a restaurant because i'm pretty sure you have a big dream don't you you have a big dream and, and, and the teachers they think that it's impossible for you to achieve that dream you can achieve that dream because at the end of the day as millennials none of us asked to be in this world you know but yeah the school system really needs to cut it out with the categorizing parents teachers 
stop stop it with the categorizing every 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 student deserves equal opportunities even if they do have low exam scores for the student that has low exam scores give them the equal recognition like you do with the other students but yeah i just wanted to chat with y'all spread some information spread some knowledge don't forget like subscribe hit the notification bell on my channel comment love y'all